So you could, you know, go through, break every single individual piece over... Over and over again until you beat your challenge. Hey, what's up guys? It's the one and only Flurpleder here and welcome back to some more Minecraft Skybound. So obviously I uploaded one yesterday and it's been a while since I've done back to back. So I'm doing a different like kind of different style of for where I'm at for recording. So I'll be doing probably ugh, probably more Skybounds, but I don't know. It, it, we'll see. You know, it might work out. So today I don't really have much planned, but before I get into that, I want to go ahead and say if you guys are still enjoying this series, we're going to aim for something insane. Let's go for 100 likes on this video. I don't know if it's possible, but my last two have gotten over 70, so if we can manage to get 100 likes on this video, that would be insane, and maybe even the next one. Also, if you enjoyed this video, comment down below. I want to know what other content you guys enjoy besides Skybounds. Because I know it, it can't just be Skybounds in your life. There has to be variety. Sometimes you gotta kind of, you know, you gotta go around. You don't want to, you know, get sick of the same thing. Yeah, wording. So, in this chest, we don't have much to open. I managed to buy, like, seven Warzone crates. I have an addiction. There's probably more in the auction house. <laughs> no, it's buried treasure. I bought, like, seven of these for, like, a mil each, and I'm just, like, I'm, like, sitting here, like, scratching my arms, like, do I buy it? Do I do it? And I, I broke down and bought them, obviously, because I needed things to open. On top of that, I had a lot of stars. I still have a good, decent bit, but I was at, like, 14 mil, so we're gonna go ahead and open up one per video to kick off every video, just to get you guys hyped up for what's to come in it hopefully we can please please give me that or the self-destruct i'll take self-destruct oh i don't i don't really want that i'll take anything else besides that honestly i have enough of those don't give me give me the arcane dust arcane dust oh thank god i thought it was gonna give me the notch apple i have like a stack of those so here we go going for the third spin what do we get i will take item xp Yes! Okay, that works for me, and that's actually perfect because today we're actually going to be doing some challenges. Because if you remember, if you didn't watch my last video, you should. I was inactive for, uh, I was inactive for a good four days. Or technically three, because the fourth, yeah, whatever. Point is, I wasn't on, well, I wasn't on here. So, we're currently getting just challenge to level top we managed to get to level 37 today from our bonus xp i think i used it all up i did so we can't do that again but i have a perfect strategy for that which is pretty sick so we have some challenges that we want to do first of all level any x to 10 and 10,000 hoe experience and that is why this this lovely thing of experience is going to come in handy if we can just go ahead and store that real quick. So, let's see if we actually have any axes that are close. We don't have any? We, we don't even have a hoe in there. Bro, what? Okay, so what we're going to do then is grab up... I don't have any diamonds. Um. <laughs> uh, okay, let me think. Iron? Uh, let me see. Okay. Uh, war Wait, I need 10,000... Hoe experience and okay, okay. I know what I'm gonna do 10,000 hoe experience and a level 10 axe. We can, oh god, the sounds. Uh, let me grab one from this. So I need one, two, one, two, three. Yeah, that's enough. Oh god, it's so loud. Oh, okay, there we go. So we're gonna go grab up some sticks. We're gonna just craft ourselves some iron hoes because the iron tools or iron hoe and iron shovel, the, or shovel. Iron Axe, because they both can reach just level 10, which is more than enough experience for what we need. So let's go and throw that in there. Let's just use the crafting table because it's right, right, right here. And let's see, do that. Do Oh, I grabbed more than what I needed, actually. Uh, Whatever. So let's grab up that. We actually don't need this other iron, but I'll keep it in my inventory. And we're going to grab up a bit of experience. I could drop a 10k on it. I think I have. No, I don't. But, but we do have some boosters. Okay, we have one for global, which I think will be perfect for this, honestly. 
it'll be for both of them so let's go ahead and drop that let's throw this in here because i don't want to waste the big experience i want to just try and toss little experience on it and see if that's enough let's start with the axe i guess we'll do the 1k on it challenge done easy easy freaking peasy and then we'll drop that on the hoe and another challenge done it didn't even level it up all the way wow uh okay well we don't really need these anymore <laughs> so there's two bottles of experience down the, not really down the drain i mean it was for a good cause it was for the challenges so now if we look we only have three other challenges i'm not going to be doing this one not sure if i'm going to be doing this one but we are going to be doing the sugarcane one because that is actually very simple i don't know how many people know about this and do this but it's very very easy kind of cheatsy oh and we're also going to be going over my island and kind of just reviewing some of the random changes that have been made to it i don't those ladders are always there well i guess this is really the only change i don't know who came on my island but someone came on my island and made a wheat farm so that's pretty neat um so to do this i can just kind of let me actually break some of this down first of all. I think I have some in my chest, but I'll go ahead and break it down because i got to break it down anyways. And then I'll show you the beautiful method I have that is kind of cheatsy, but at the same time it's not. I don't know. <laughs> I, I, it seems fair to me. Kind of. I don't know. Whatever. So you could, you know, go through, break every single individual piece over, over and over again until you beat your challenge. Or you could sit on one of these, hold down both your buttons, and just instantly beat this challenge. I don't know how this is going to work on dirt, to be honest, because it's tempting to, it's tempted to break, but you could just sit here. This, this is it. And actually, before I continue, I'm turning down my sounds, because God, that is loud. So you just, just sit here. Just chill here. Break, you know, Sugar King. Talk about your day. How you, how you, how's your guys' day going? Enjoying this Skybounds video? I really hope you are. If you do, remember... 100 likes slap one on it and uh leave a comment down below tell me your other your other favorite game mode besides this i don't know what you guys like i want to know because i do want to do other varieties i don't want to be just a skybounds channel but i'm going to be doing more because i gotta be eat doing just one a week seems a little unfair to you guys since the majority of you have built my channel because you enjoy skybounds you know but in brighter news my channel managed to grow like 35 subscribers from being inactive, which is absolutely insane for me. I think I've done better than that probably, but from being inactive, that's insane. So it's going to be a while for this challenge, um, but there's not really much I can do for this video. Uh, I don't really have anything planned out, but I'm going to go ahead, I guess, take a pause until we're almost done with this challenge because I don't want to just sit here and bore you guys with this. So I'll see you in a little bit. Alright, so we are actually about to complete this challenge any second now, but you know. We're just there we go. Challenge complete. That actually took a good bit of time, so I'm glad I decided to cut, because that would be so annoying to watch more than likely. So right now, we do have one other challenge we could complete on our island, specifically on our island. Can't go to any other island or anywhere else. I think on other islands, but and we have the coal set out. This is probably enough to do it and i might do that in a bit maybe but before we do that i want to go ahead and just kind of look around my island because you know just kind of a recap of the island right now so obviously i've got all my beautiful player heads in this room these are like the og ones some of the well some of them are new some of them are the ones i've got earlier throughout this we also got another quiff head um i sold him or i let him sell the last one i actually gotta replace the glass up here i didn't realize it was all broken but we got a quiff head and i gotta find a better spot for it i might i might just raise this up one I, I don't know i'll find something for it in the future but we're gonna go ahead uh, also there's the hall of flurps we have that one dude's head uh hoe is it yeah the hoe in there so that's pretty cool kind of wanted to see what i need to do to my island one thing i know i need to do uh, check my gifts i, I check you know i'm gonna check that i haven't checked that since i actually came back to skybounds from the four days and no wi-fi i need to update this because if you see that little red rim it's like netherrack just kind of kind of make it look how fancy i need to also update my castle make it look better that's one thing but I need to update this map so it looks how it's supposed to. I also need to finish up this, but I'm not entirely sure what I want to do there quite yet. I have an idea in mind, but I just got to get the materials and time to make it happen. Maybe in a video in the future, I also need to work on this area. I've been lazy there. So let's just kind of fly around. I do want to see, um, kind of 
visualize what I want to do. So we finished up with our party room, obviously. I'm going to turn it into a... Oh, yeah, that's right. There's a diamond block. I left it in here. I'm going to turn it into a headroom, obviously. We got this abomination of a head here. We've got these heads. I really like this one, and I really like this one. I think they kind of go together. It's like a kind of a different version of um, Hero Brine, and then a Derp Steve, which is beautiful. We also added some more heads over here. Eventually, we're gonna, uh, of course, fill this wall up. So we got some new ones along here. We got Puss and Boots over here. Um, and then a banana freaking derp over there. So we want to fill this up. I'm thinking I want to do a center platform and do like a epic, uh, more epic than what I've done fountain thing and then do a kind of hedge, not really maze, but hedge circles around it and just all the way around, do, do something neat with it. But it's gonna take a lot of work for that. I also really like the fire, just side note, I really like the fire in this texture pack because it's red. I think there's some fire I need to find in real light, but I don't know. Also over here we got, oh, lag. We got the area that Burning Arrow, well he built this, and then Opal is supposed to be working more on this eventually, I think. Is there actually materials in this chest? Yeah. There's one thing I wanna do. I wanna move some things from a chest to another chest because I've got just random chests scattered around. I'll probably do that eventually, maybe on video, maybe not, probably not. I was gonna do it on this video, just go through, clean up my island, but yeah, it's kind of just boring. I just kind of want to look around a bit, show you guys more of it, because I haven't really looked around my island since I've done anything on video. I've done most of it off camera and then be like, okay, I did some cool things over there, and you know, they're there, you gotta believe me. So I've added some trees to kind of just, you know, make it look a little bit better, and I went with a dark oak, because they're the biggest, and they kind of just really bring out the medieval look of it. Uh, and then, of course, I got, you know, my farms and stuff, which I don't know why someone put a wheat farm on my island when I have a wheat farm here, but it's okay. We don't care. It doesn't matter. We've also got, you know, this here. I want to fill in dirt uh, in different areas. Well, not around here. This area is going to stay as it is, but I am going to eventually fill this up, make it a little river. I might get help with that maybe in the future. I'm not sure. I've also got this, which... Uh, it looks goofy, but I'm honestly proud of it. You know, it's my own thing. And then, of course, we did finish the steampunk area over here. I gotta put a glowstone on that. We did finish the steampunk little area over here. I just need to add dirt throughout here. A lot of my projects need dirt. That's annoying. I might add another... Nah, nah I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this, to be honest. I guess I'm gonna go ahead and uh, kind of just... Oh, oh, another thing. I also have a secret project in mind. I forget what it was. I remember I was told, I uh, got the idea with Cat, and I forget what it was, but it's gonna be some somewhere this way, past these farms. It's gonna be pretty sweet, so eventually that'll be a thing, because I do need to fill out, I want to fill out the entire map as much as I can up towards here. I think I can go, yeah, I can go, actually wait, yeah, yeah, I can go up two more here, because this would be the middle. This would be, you know, zero, zero, basically, but not really. This is the spawn, so we can go about one and a half down and one and a half up one and a half left one and a half right i'm not well no actually only one right and one left well actually i don't i don't really know how far i can go this way let's find out actually because i haven't really looked this way i it, wait let me make sure i have island borders on do i have yes i do okay so the island border should be about over here i believe or Maybe not. Maybe I can go quite a way, actually. Okay, it's right here. So the island border is here. Um, we do have a good way, a bit of way that way. I don't know why that one stretches so far. Maybe it's not an exact, like, middle point, but I don't know. I kind of want to just work with it, you know, even it out a bit, do something with it, make it neat looking. But I guess I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take a cut until I'm ready to complete this challenge. I'm going to get to mining away. Hope you guys are enjoying this part, to this point. This little, you know, kind of just look over of my island, all the things that I've done. I also want to complete this. I think this is pretty much complete as is, but I want to, you know, kind of just do something with it. I mean, it's a sand area mostly, but, you know, I also might want to make a actual mob spawning platform in case I need creepers of my own. So I might do that maybe further out that way as well or somewhere. I don't know, but I'm going to go ahead and complete this challenge. If you guys are enjoying up to this point, remember to slap a like on it, and I will see you guys when we're ready to finish this challenge. All right, guys, we are back, and we are actually almost done with this. Like, we're at 93% of the challenge done just from mining this all once. Like, 
I really thought it would take longer than that, but it didn't. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, kind of start outroing now. I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. I've said it like, what, three, four times in this video. I honestly do mean it. If you did, remember to slap a like on it, leave a comment telling me what your favorite minigame besides Skybounds is, your favorite content to watch, I guess, or play even, and uh, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and if you're, if you're new to the channel, obviously, and hit that notification bell if you want to be notified every time I upload on this channel, and if you don't want to hit that notification bell, then you can just remember that every day at 4pm EST is when I'm going to upload, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Shoot. Oh, I hit him once. Okay. Okay. At least I hit him once. I don't know how much health he would be on. Wish I could have the damage indicators, but I can't. Crap. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, no. He's going to get away. I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. Where did he have gone? Huh? He got away. That's just not fun. Oh. Oh, hey! I didn't miss the landing after all. Nice.